Hi guys, welcome to FDN. Welcome. There's um, no announcements. No announcements. Uh, um, junior High uploaded their episode, so... It was Halloween a few days ago. That was cool. Yeah, um... It's November now. You know what that means? What does that mean? I don't know. What do you think it means? It means it's November. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Clay, what are you, what's happening? Oh, it's No Shave November. Wow. The staff are doing it. You don't have to if you don't want to. Yeah. I know Mr. Gens, uh, you know, shaved his entire face. Yeah, that's scary. That's, yeah. that's like, look, it's like... It's, it's like it's looking at a new man. I'll do it, but I'm going to only keep it to the mustache. I'm not, I'm going <laughs> to shave the beard because you can't see me with a beard. I'll look like a punk. You know, when you think about it, when people say you look good with a beard, they're saying that you look better with with hiding half your face. <laughs> yeah, because no one wants to see that. <laughs> By the end of this month, I will have, like, the most pure mustache. I'll get mustache wax. You know, you'll have, like, it. you'll have a, just as good as Mr. Corrigan's mustache from Halloween. Yeah, yeah that was scary. Don't ever <laughs> do that again. Don't be mean to him. Well, I guess his wife also said that, so, yeah. you know. Listen to your wife. I am wearing a green shirt. I should probably put on something besides a green shirt. <laughs> It's Clay's Question Corner Time featuring, um, Sean, <laughs> Sean Kenneth Daniels, the second. Uh, howdy, Sean. How's, how's it, how's it hanging? Hanging. It's hanging. Would you like to answer some questions with me, Sean? Sure. I would okay. like to do that. All right, Sean. Of the senior <laughs> class. Who is secretly a superhero? Cody. Cody Catlett. He's a superhero. Who of the senior class, or which three people, will become famous and why? Sean here, he's gonna become the next Leonardo da Vinci, and he's gonna create the Mona Lisa 2, which was significantly better than Mo Mona Lisa 1. That's, that's just classic Sean, budget clay. He'll rent himself out so much that he gets so much cash flow from that that he can just retire and never have to work again. When are you getting official Clay Clay's Question Corner merch? Oh, official Clay's Question Corner merch that will be dropping soon. I have no idea when, but it, it's coming. We'll get like little mugs that say "Watch Clay's Question Corner" on it. Play me on iMessage games. Five, six, three. Dude, you know what the problem with that is? I have a Samsung phone, so no more iMessage games for you, boy. What made you start FDN? Oh, back in the beginning? Oh, it was just like I was being myself and Miss Noble was like, Man, Clay, I sure do love you. I wish you would come start the show because I can't live without you and I need you. You are like, you're the prodigy of life. You're, you have made my life peak. You've made my life peak. Everything's gonna be downhill from here once you leave. Those were, those were her precise words. Came straight from her mouth. Nah, nah, nah. 100 percent. 100% true. You have a YouTube channel. Oh yeah. It's called Eliza Muscatine Falcon Daily News. You're watching it right now. Click that subscribe button. Look at it. Look at it right here. Now it's on Sean's face. Gosh dang it, Sean. Oh, he just put it back. Good job. That's gonna be a lot of editing. That's all of them. Wow, Sean. This, let's all give Sean a round of applause. You hear that stock footage clapping in the background? That's all for Sean. He did a good job. Good job, Sean. Now tell them to all follow me on Twitter at ClayQuestionMan. Point to it. Look at it. Look at that. Look. Now it's moving. And it's going in circles. And now Sean's just going off the camera, never to be seen again. Okay, um, 
Put the questions in the box. Bye. Welcome everybody to this week's show. Uh, we got clay this time since, you know, uh, Caleb wasn't here again. Hello, students to the office, please. Hayden Cavillage, Cody Cavillage, Stephen Hayes, Nick Morales. Man, those kids. Man. <laughs> being, being bad. I'm here to ask you a few questions about Clay's Question Corner. Obviously, because that's the only thing that you do in your entire life, and it's, yeah. you know, when the camera's not on, you guys don't know this, but Clay just doesn't exist. Yeah. Uh, he only exists when the camera's on. That's why it's so hard to talk to him and learn how to do FDN because he's just not here 70% yeah. of the time. Uh, so it really stinks not being alive that 70% of the time. 70% of the time, he's just... You know, this 30% of the time I'm alive, it, it, it sure is sweet. It's precious. <laughs> That's why he's so excited every week when it's Clay Swatch Corner because he, he gets to live. Yeah. Life is good. And sometimes we leave the, we leave the camera on and that, some extra time so you can just eat. Yeah, I I sure do enjoy food. We got like five hours of footage of just me eating <laughs> food and existing. Except when he walks out of frame, he disappears too, so he can only you know, stay in frame. That's why I gotta stay in this frame, or because if the camera moves, then no, it's a no go, man. Uh, so what what made you devote your entire life to Clay's Question Corner? Uh, I sold my soul to the devil. It seems like a lot of people do it in the, nowadays, you know? You know. A lot of people make deals with the devil as well. Um, you know? The little Johnny and the devil in Georgia. Yeah. He, he was looking for a soul steal that day. Yeah. You know? but he got a golden fiddle. No, yeah. he didn't. No, he didn't. No, he gave, he gave he it back. He was offered he, the golden fiddle. He was offered fiddle, the golden he fiddle. He gave it back to the devil he because didn't. he didn't want it. What What's your honest opinion on the devil? He, he's he pretty should. lame, what, right? Yeah. I don't like him. He's, he pretty, he's a pretty crappy dude. Here's another question. Uh, what is your opinion on Budget Clay at the moment? Budget Clay sure is a, sure is a, um, he's a guy. Sometimes we don't agree, but you know, that's his opinion. Respect but, other people's opinions. Respect, people. Respecting other people's opinions, especially if they're also a cheaper version of you. Uh, respect your teachers. Yeah, respect them. Don't Photoshop them to make them look like Shrek. Yeah, don't. I, who would do such a thing? Yeah. It's gonna be sad when I leave because then... Then I'll have to take on being stuck in the camera, you know? You know... Because when you graduate from school, you get to you get to live another life, but, you know... You know, that's, that's, really, that's really gonna be some sad stuff right now. Yeah. I'm gonna miss, I'm gonna miss all you guys. Yeah, Clay, what do you think... This is real talk here. What what do you think about graduating? You know, is sad. Um, it's gonna be scary moving on into the real life because you know this has been my life for 14 years. And it's, yeah, I guess it would be 14 years. It's, it's gonna be real hard. I'm gonna miss I'm gonna miss all you guys. Message to everyone. Message to everyone. Except for people who we don't know. We won't miss you because we don't know you. I'll miss. I'll well, miss I you. won't miss anyone right now because I'll still have another year of this. Yeah. Next year when I'm gone, I want you guys to treat David with as much respect as possible because this man, he's your future. Even though I might not be good at you know making shows, putting it together, I try my best, and that's what's important. And I learn. You think? Clay over here is. Have you messed? seen the first episode of Clay's <laughs> Question Corner? Have you seen the first episode of literally every any show except for shows on TV? Well, actually, some of those are bad. But. Yeah. You ever? If you ever watch a show, if you ever have watched a show consecutively and you've watched the later seasons and then you go back to the first ever season and you see how those characters yeah, evolved. Like, over I don't time. even. I don't, I don't even have. Uh, Evolution. Yet. I'm still. I'm still a. I'm still a frog in a pond. Yeah. He. I need to grow. Well, I'm a fish in a pond. I need to grow legs. See, I need every to evolve. Time, every yeah. time we do these episodes, you get to learn more about us. You get to learn more about my life. We get to bond together. Bond. James Bond. This has been a very heartfelt episode. Hotel. Trivago. Thank you to our sponsor, Trivago. Yeah. We'd like to thank 
everyone who's given us all this support. It's very this cool. really should have just been, you know, the last episode where we're thinking about. Yeah, this should have been the last episode. <laughs> this should have been the last episode. Oh, dang. <laughs> Guess we accidentally put it in the middle of the year. But, uh, jokes on you, we film all of our episodes and we just accidentally put this in the middle. Dang. And have anything to say before I leave, Clay? I sure do appreciate all you guys for watching. Um, You'll probably see this exact same episode just at a different time <laughs> later this year. Yeah, um, this is this is a really heartfelt episode, but we'd like to thank you for getting us to where we are today. You know who I don't think? Budget Clay. Yeah, and also Caleb, because you didn't show up today yeah, for the second time Caleb. in a row. You didn't show up, and we have to put our final yeah. episode in the middle of this <laughs> one here. What's you, wrong with you? Yeah, this... <sighs> Alright. Um, goodbye. You didn't, you didn't announce your name or where we're at. Oh! oh. Where, where do you think we're at? Um, use your mind's eye. This is, mm, this is Venice. Venice? 1952. Wow. Because you see all the greasers back here in Venice <laughs> all those <laughs> with, their, with their leather leather jackets on isn't Venice like a water place like it, there's water they build stuff. it on top of the water that's pretty neat so there's all these greasers driving um, around in their souped up boats I guess my name for this episode will be um, David Letterman David Letterman and this is Conan O'Brien yes Welcome to Tonight with Jimmy Fallon. <laughs> Bye. Oh, God. <laughs> David, you hooligan. <laughs> I think I'll fix it.